plop yourself down on the couch for a very interesting therapy session as two of the greatest minds of the 20th century link up together. We caught up with the Emmy nominated actor Matthew Good and director Matthew Brown of the film Freud's Last Session. Take a look. I'm so born. But this does put a smile on my face. We've seen great battles in superhero films. Now, a new movie brings a fresh heavyweight matchup. This one between renowned psychologist Sigmund Freud and the Chronicles of Narnia author C.S. Lewis. Dr. Freud. Sit, please. Not there. That's the transformation couch. You be careful. <laughs> Why would you come here to see me if you disagree so passionately with my views? You've insisted all your lives that the very concept of God is ludicrous. Yes. Clash between God and Satan. Ah, but I did not say whose side I was on. I consider what people tell me far less interesting than what they choose not to tell me. Starring as Dr. Freud, two-time Oscar winner, the legendary Anthony Hopkins. C.S. Lewis is invited to Freud's house, and when he gets there, he finds out that he's going to be invited to a debate about, um, about the existence of God. Nearing the end of Freud's life, two of the 20th century's greatest minds come together on the eve of the Second World War to question their own personal philosophies. You lie to yourself, thinking that you can control death the way you control your world and your daughter. You believe that you can outthink your fear by hiding behind your desk in your den of gods, but the truth is you're terrified. Playing author and scholar C.S. Lewis is Emmy-nominated actor Matthew Good. He's a professor at Magdalen College and uh, at Oxford, which is a very prestigious, prestigious university. And you know, he, he was just uh, just getting started with his career as a Christian apologist, um, which is which people don't know. Christian apologist apolo that comes from apologia, which is the Greek, which means to speak in defence of. Why someone of your supreme intellect would suddenly abandon truth and then embrace a ludicrous dream, an insidious lie? Well, I wholeheartedly disagree. Well, of course you disagree. You have to disagree. Otherwise, the entire structure of your childish faith would collapse into a rubble. Why does religion make room for science, but science refuses to make room for religion? Oh, please, you're breaking my heart. Freud was obviously aware of him, and uh, and that's that's the conceit of our film, is that, is that you, if you're going to talk to anybody, you want to talk to someone who is seemingly a bit of an expert on it. And talking about experts... What was it like to work with one of the greatest actors to grace the screen? I've grown up loving all of his performances, so I was very, very nervous. Sometimes you should meet your heroes, is what I would say. Freud's Last Session is out now in theaters.